Hmm. Yeah, I kind of look weird without makeup on. I look kind of like a, a washed up sewer rat is how I used to describe it. And I kind of feel like that's still accurate. I look kind of like, like, like weird. I just don't look right. Any, I'm not ready yet because I had to check out of the other resort and now I'm at Saratoga Springs and um, I don't know what to do with my day because I don't leave till tomorrow. Oh my gosh, so, oh my gosh, so much happened. So I got the Magical Express which I have not done in so long. And I know that I'm in the video for the Magical Express getting a drink at Baseline. And this is my opportunity to hopefully see it. Okay, so I'm taking the Magical Express. I have to be up to the front by three o'clock in the morning because my departure time is 3.30. Because the only flight I could get, even though it's like, you would think it would be exciting to get two extra Disney days. And I'm kind of like, no, I am not too thrilled about it. This is it, this is uh, our room. It's um, pretty much the same exact one that I showed you guys last time. You got your grocery hanger, you've got the closet, you've got your safe, your iron, and hiding in the back. Look at this little guy. And then, you know, your little kitchen area with you got your blenders up here. I already set this for the morning. I'm mentally prepared. I never use the coffee makers in the room until recently because I'm like, I'm gonna live on the edge. I got two Rice Krispie treats. I got some Space 220 doodads. One Tide Pod left. A couple fuel rods. Some water. Obviously you have a super fancy cabinetry in here. I think this is kind of like the red room because you can't get in it. Aha! Uh -huh. And then we see in the bathroom, we've got the most beautiful tile work I have ever seen in my life. Oh yes, made from cow's milk, that's for sure. Let's test out the water pressure. Okay, here we go. Aha, oh, hold on. No? Oh yeah. That's the pressure that'll shoot your eye out. And then obviously, oh, obvious, oh, obviously we are staying. <laughs> obviously we are staying first class because of this and that's how you always can know. They will never want you to board out without having the triangle. It's like a little character, hello there. It's like an origami frog cleanest toilets on this side of the coast and yeah I kind of got um, bored so I just flopped in the bed for no reason at all and then I moved <laughs> I repacked my suitcase I'd like organized it as best as I could I don't know well that way I like unpacking will be easier oh here's all my souvenirs of the trip you would maybe assume that I was a child but I am not and then this is my setup this is how I edit my videos and do things. I'm gonna be the person who actually rips this out of its packing. This remote has not been out of that seal in who knows how long. Suitcase weighs so much and, okay, so I have the backpack ready to go. And then Burn got me this. It's a little fossil keychain and it's a Dalmatian. It's a little Gracie girl. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Duh. The view. Hello. Your disorganization skills are top notch, Veronica. Let's see. I like it. I kind of like being on the first floor. Do you remember last time I got to stay like right facing um, springs? So my view in the morning was literally of the springs. It was so cool. But maybe we could sneak out here later at night. Oh, I will be getting up at three o'clock in the morning so I can show you guys. All right, yeah, that's it. That's the room tour. But here's my thoughts. So in the morning, I need to be up at the front by 3 a.m. So I have to drag my suitcases and my backpack, which are really heavy for some reason, and go to the main building, which is not an easy walk. 
I have not worn ears one time this trip, mostly because I didn't realize I had any besides one pair. But this whole time I was packed from last trip and never unpacked my ears. So we are looking spectacular. We're gonna go to Hollywood Studios. I heard that the Muppets have like a new, um, the Muppets 3D has a uh, Haunted Mansion Muppets, which I have not seen yet. And maybe try some Halloween snackies because I will not be back again for Halloween. I was going to take an Uber, but since it's my last Disney day for like a long time, we're gonna bus. The buses just remind me of like happier times. The buses that were here are going to Epcot, and it says on, you know, the little sign that 328 is our bus. And our bus is here. Look at the nice wood flooring. This has come so far from the 90s and early 2000s. It looks so good in here. And they have little USB chargers down here. Wow, Disney has sure come a long way. I am so excited, I don't even know why. It's the music, everything's getting me like, woohoo, I'm so excited. I got like my little pumpkin spirit. <laughs> right out of the gate, we got a win. We got Mickey and Minnie waiting for us, right here above the bathrooms. So my first stop on like Halloween snacks that I didn't do at all yet is at Rosie's and it's like a witch's thing. But I never noticed inside of here all the aviation and like Mickey and Donald and all that stuff. It's like really cute. Okay, and this magical little thing here is whipped blackberry panna cotta on green apple mousse with crispy salted caramel perils and chocolate shortbread cookie. I think the whipped blackberry panna cotta with green apple mousse sounds horrible but the salted caramel perils, perils and shortbread cookie that might make it work out. So apparently there's a cat up here in this bush. I don't see him. Oh, I see him. He's moving. Oh my God, here he comes. He's chasing a lizard. Let me move him in. He's chasing that lizard. There he is. Oh my gosh, he looks like Rita with eyes. Do you guys see him? Hi. Oh my God, I'm a sucker for animals. There he is. I honestly don't think I've ever seen a Disney World cat. This might be my first time. Oh, I don't want to see that thing. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. I like Benelli. Where are you going? He's out of here. Tastes like fake fruit. Like, you know, like fruit flavoring? That's what this is. That's all. Let me show you guys. Like fake, gooey fruit. All right, now I'm gonna make my way down towards like the Muppets area and see if I can get like one of the Haunted Mansion stretching portrait eclairs. If you didn't know, I have the Haunted Mansion stretching portraits tattooed to the back of my leg. Oh, yep, that's got a glare, but you know it's there. There you go. It smells absolutely amazing in here. For this being ranked Disney's worst pizza, I've had it before and it really was not that bad. Like sincerely, the pizza here was pretty good. And if you didn't know, sincerely is my favorite word. To me, it just really emphasizes like that I'm serious. Like sincerely, like sincerely, I mean it. The pizza here was not that bad. Honestly, I had a worse time at Trotteria Al Forno. That was a weird. I don't want to talk about it. You know they say anyone can cook, including Rizzo. Hold on a second. Anyone can cook, including Rizzo. And Rizzo is a rat. Remy, Rizzo. Oh, I'm so lucky. I got the tightrope walker girl, and it looks like I have the haunted mansion pattern. I can't really tell. So I figured we would come sit by Pizza Rizzo, not Pizza Rizzo, the Muppet Vision, and try our little babies. So this is my current situation. It just figures I kind of would mess mine up. And then this is the frozen apple cider with whiskey and cinnamon. It is so refreshing and amazing. Oh my gosh, this is so good. I don't even drink whiskey. Maybe I didn't get to the whiskey or something because there's no way this would be that good. Anyway, both of these eclairs are the exact same. Reminds me of the one they had last.
last year, the bone one, but better. Oh, good. Look at my fingers. This is after wiping them. These are very messy little babies, but they are good nonetheless. So this tree is actually multi-purpose. All right, now, in honor of Muppets Vision Haunted Mansion, we're gonna go do Muppet Vision. It's a beautiful day here. Like, really, 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 really nice out. And I am purple. Yeah, but today, I want to tell you all about this special Oh my gosh, this is getting me so excited. Oh my gosh, I just missed the part. The 999 flipped over and turned into 666. And they go, everyone that doesn't watch this is going to go to... And then they're like, no, 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 no. more than old MGM Studios. Nothing. They took away the best part of this park for Star Wars and Toy Story. All right, next stop on my snacky excursion on my uh, diet. This day is not even supposed to be happening. This is all because of the flight being canceled and getting an extra two days. I was doing really good, and then I got sick of being good. There he is. He's just a spooky little thing. Now I'm gonna drag him all the way back down to Tower of Terror to get a picture of him with me together in person for the last time. So I did drag him all the way down to Tower of Terror to get some pictures with him. And I like did chop here. <laughs> from Be Our Guest, the gray stuff thing. And it's all over my nose. That was weird. I'm a mess. Yeah, I am a mess. So like, I'm like purple and black. It's like just a disaster over here. Now he kind of looks like a melted snowman. Oh my gosh, I bit his eyes off. All right, now that we've consumed two desserts. No, oh my gosh. I'm lying, four desserts, and walked right down the middle of Sunset Boulevard. We're gonna do Tower of Terror. It's my favorite ride here. Oh no, it's the bowler hat man from The Haunting of Hill House. I'm laughing so hard because somebody put googly eyes on this statue. <laughs> They are. I have not seen any 50th statues yet besides the Bambi at Animal Kingdom. Look at how cute they are. Bo Peep's hips looking fly as always. Do you know what would be like the dumbest name ever for a YouTube channel? <laughs> yeah, that's about accurate. Keeping on the Muppets theming here that we don't really have going on in this video. Look at that really big pot. I am so excited for this. As a huge Haunted Mansion fan, this is going to die for. No, it's going to be to die something, something. I don't know. You get it. Gracie? Look at all the Gracies. So now I'm going to head over to Tower of Terror and try to see if I can get the projections that are on there for like the 50th. I wanted to watch the animation show that happens, but I have a flight at 3 in the morning. I'm never going to make it. Look at how cute Sebastian and Flounder are. I have not seen a lot of the 50th statues. I love them. I love you very much. I can see it. I can see them partying up to the right hand side. It's kind of like Christmas time here right now. There we go. Walk at a time. 
talk about I would really reconsider doing this, being parked on the totally other side of the carriage house when you have Magical Express at three o'clock in the morning and you're lugging your suitcase. Oh my gosh. It has been so long since I've used the Magical Express. You know, I'm going right to the back towards that bathroom. It's early. Now the only problem is, is that I don't know if I'm on the way here or the way back. You know what Disney, it's a darn shame that you're getting rid of this. You are taking away all of the things that made you extra special. What are you gonna do? Like what are you, I'm just so sick of it. Disney has changed so much. Even within like the last five years, Disney has become the most high, everything just, <laughs> I wouldn't even be surprised with what's next. Like I, am, almost everything I'm like hearing, I'm not even shocked anymore. I'm like, they might as well just start charging $500 a day. I wouldn't even be surprised. I keep like thinking like, what's next? They're gonna like charge you like a fee to like make dining reservations. Like, I don't know. Like there's just so many like things that they're just, <sighs> it's very strange. Cause it's pretty much the main thing I love in life. And also, like, the main thing that's giving me, like, that, like, ugh feeling, like, ugh, come on. It's like a relationship that's going south, and you want to fix it so bad, and you, like, want to get past all the bad things that they keep doing, because you do love them so much. I can't explain it. I know what they could do next. They're going to start charging us to even, like, use the bus. They're going to be like, if you guys want to use our free transportation, it's not going to be so free anymore. And they're going to be like... It's $10 a day to use buses here. Like, it's gonna be just something so ridiculous. Welcome to Disney Magical Express. For your safety and <laughs> That would safety. happen. Got our bags. We can look at some 50th like decorations because we're really early. Honestly, I'm gonna miss it. I mean, I haven't done it since like for a while, like for a long time, but I'm like kind of sad. Look at that. They got like this like 50th wall over here with the 50th teacup. Unfortunately, I'm on Southwest. And I say unfortunately for a number of reasons right now. I guess there's not a number of them. I'm being a little over dramatic. Besides that, I couldn't get a flight for two days. I could have forked out the money and paid $1,000 to get on American, but no. Look at that. Look at you can see Spaceship Earth. And the, oh. I see this line here, and I'm already going to guess the Southwest. Well, it seems like they're like all setting up shop and they're putting like camera crews up because it was um, a weird weekend here. Now the line goes all the way down there. It really wasn't that bad. I think it like took 10 minutes, maybe. And it was sure a lot more organized than Spirit, but I never had issues with Spirit. Everybody complains about them. I've never been delayed, never been canceled, never anything. And I've used them probably 50 times. So that says something. So I waited to like, till everyone cleared out of like the monorail here to get like some of this. I love it. I'm kind of sad to be going home. I did get like my two extra bonus days and I keep repeating the same thing over and over. And I did get to miss a day of work, which isn't good because I literally need my money. But you know, things happen. I'm sure they hate me. No, they don't. Oh my God, in the middle is even cuter. Hold on. Look at it! Figment, Mini, Simba. Oh my gosh, I love it. Orange Bird, Bambi, Bo Peep, Mickey, Frozone, Donald, Pumbaa. 
We did it. We made it. So far. If anybody ever is like, you know what, I want to buy you a drink, this is my drink of choice. If they have it in zero, I prefer that too, but usually it's only in the gallons, and I have it stocked up in my fridge.